Like literally, I almost fucking hogar me. Anyways, guys, welcome back to my motherfucking canal. Today we have another motherfucking vlog for you guys because y'all bitches know. Well, I know that y'all bitches love motherfucking vlogs. So today, you guys, is our first day back from vacation. And let me just tell you guys, yesterday dormí como un angelito. Like literally, I did not realize how much I love my bed until yesterday. Like I went a whole fucking four days without my camita. That yesterday when I fucking threw my Stuff on there. Quedé dormido como un niño chiquito. Like, I don't know. Did you miss your bed, babe? Mm -hmm. Like, honestly, I, I just fell asleep and I never wanted to wake up. But then I realized that today is un día de trabajo. So I was like, ¿sabes qué? Me tengo que levantar y hacer un chingo de cosas. So let me tell you what today we're going to do, you guys. Right now, me and Danny are about to go have breakfast. I know I've said this a lot, you guys, but me and Danny are starting a diet tomorrow. Yo sé que siempre digo que voy a empezar dietas y sé que siempre me las termino comiendo because, like, I always end up failing on my diet. Y luego de ahí, we're going to probably go to South Coast Plaza because I have to go buy Martina regalito because tomorrow's his birthday is so I'm thinking true? no it's tomorrow but I'm not gonna be able to hang out with them tomorrow I have to go buy him some sandals I want to go Dude, buy him some oh sandals God, like some Gucci him. ones or I don't know what kind of sandals but si le quiero comprar unos sandals because he's been wanting some sandals de marca so that's gonna kind of be what I'm gonna get him y luego después de eso um, we have dinner with him my sister and Martin's brother tonight I invited them out to go have dinner but honestly ni sabemos a donde vamos a ir a comer my sister wants me to choose but I'm like yo por que no es mi cumpleaños like what the fuck does Martin like you know what I mean so we're probably gonna go out to eat like at some marisco place because Martin loves loves his mariscos so that is kind of what we're gonna do today and also if we have time well we are gonna have time but what else are we doing babe we're gonna go um look for dogs yeah, you guys, I've been wanting a dog. I also feel like after Richie passed away, I feel like I went into like a little, I don't know, even more of a depression because I'm gonna be honest, when we had Richie, I feel like I was getting my shit together. Like the day I got Richie, like I was like, okay, you know what? Like, me tengo que poner las pilas. I'm gonna get my shit together. Y cuando falleció Richie, like, you guys know me, I'm always home alone and, be, and I hate being home alone. So, like, having someone else with me, even if it's an animal, makes me feel so much better. So, we're gonna go see um, some dogs, you know, we're gonna go to some shelters, and hopefully, nos enamoremos de uno y lo agarramos. Wow, Dani. Wow, qué bonito maneja. Hoy no anda como loco. Usually, guys, Danny drives like a fucking maniac, pero como que hoy anda bien calmadito. You know, his first ay pendejo. Stop. <laughs> That's not funny, dumbass. Anyways, I spoke to soon. You guys, una cosa que les quiero decir, I showered today, okay, don't think I didn't shower. I just look a little, like, dirty because no rasuré mi panocha, like, literally. Like, I just shaved a day ago y ya me crecieron todos los pinches pelos. Like, what the fuck? Like, can these fucking pelitos, like, slow the fuck down? Me salen caro los putos rastrillos because I'm the type of bitch, you guys. I only use the rastrillos once y ya. You know what I mean? Like, I only use them once and ya fue todo. But right now, um, we're about to pull up to the restaurant. Hopefully, there's not a big ass line because a bitch don't like lines. Like, and a bitch is hungry. And a bitch is hungry. I'm not really that hungry. I'm, I'm like, I'm, I'm mild. Uh, I'm mild. You know? Is someone honking at me? No. They honked at me. Oh, you fucking bitch. Not so, at me. oh my god. Oh, I have this sticker on my laptop. That. Yo, dude, what's wrong with you burping? I'm being serious. Hi. You're what's wrong with me. Es que te miro y me da asco. All right, you guys. So we just got here, and this is my favorite restaurant. I'm actually not gonna post it because then you guys are gonna come. And... No, let them come. Okay, I'll... and then maybe we could get free food. Okay, I'll I'll just let you guys know. It's then... called El Camino Cafe in um, Tustin, but it's so packed. So this is why I don't want to tell y'all because then when I come, it's gonna be super packed. <laughs> I'm just kidding, y'all. I love y'all. We ended up paying forty dollars for two water bottles and a chilaquiles. So like when I tell you this is kind of pricey, it's pretty pricey. But I just love it. Look, 
La Perra. Oh, it's La Perra, sorry. Sorry about that. Guys, you guys, I just wanna show you guys this. This drink is so fucking bomb. It's literally a dirty horchata. So what that means, no pendeja, no esta sucia. Like, this ain't dirty like you bitches. This is basically half horchata and like half cafe. Half espresso. Espresso. And it's really fucking good. And when you mix it, it turns to like a cafe. But the horchata, like it's really good you know Joke. you guys so this is what we got um i got pure arroz and then green chilaquiles with oh, oh my god look at Irma. <laughs> hi ew Irma's in mexico right now you guys she got deported no she's not in mexico anymore. oh she's not in mexico anymore? no dude we got she just got back well um so i got arroz Chila green chilaquiles the steak you guys you can tell this is real steak like it's really that bomb Mood, did you guys see that? The señora is like straight up staring at me. She's like, what is this Mexican? Yeah, she's probably like, what is he doing? This was so good, you guys. Que casi lambo el pinche plato. Like, Danny's not even done. Y yo ya me lo tragué todo. Like, literally, when I say this place is bomb, créanme because it's bomb, okay? We just got finished eating, and I think we're gonna go where? South Coast? South Coast fast though, like I'm not trying to kick it there. Jeremy? We can go to Bloomingdale. Just one, yeah, one store and that's it. So right now you guys, vamos a ir a South Coast Plaza. I look like fucking shit. Like I can already tell que me van a tratar como mierda because así es como me miro. But like, you know what? I don't give a fuck because when I pay for that bitch, when I pay for whatever I'm gonna buy, se van a quedar con la boca abierta because that happens to me a lot. You guys, whenever I go to like these bougie stores, but not Gucci. Like, not Gucci. Gucci, Gucci, Gucci treats me good all the time. And all the time. Louis Vuitton though, nomás me miran y dicen, ese güey parece rata. They judge. They, they judge. judge. They judge. But like, every single time I go to bougie stores looking like shit, you guys, I feel like literally they always like kind of judge me. Like they're like, oh, yes, este pobre ton que está haciendo aquí. And then you come out with $20,000. And then like I come out buying stuff and they're like, ay, shit. Guys, oh my God, look at this Fendi bag. Oh my God, okay, I cannot get anything because me voy a quedar en la calle. Oh my God, there's way too many cute stuff. You guys, you guys know I'm obsessed with MCM. Like my sandalias are from oh, MCM. So and this MCM like duffel bag or whatever they're called oh, look, is look, so look. cute. Oh my god, look at the pink one. I like this one. This one's super cute. Está 500 dólares? No, I don't want it. I'm not gonna get it, you guys. I'm gonna be strong. Martin has been wanting designer stuff for a while, so le voy a cumplir su sueño. Y se lo voy a hacer. What is he MCM. Oh yeah, he has an MCM wallet, but he's been wanting Gucci, so... I'm gonna get him something from, from Gucci and he's gonna make it look Fucci. I'm low-key shook, you guys. So, um, I was about to pay and they told me that I had rewards points and a bitch got a, like, really good deal. Like, I ended up getting the sandals for, like, 150 which is really, really cheap because I had a lot of, like, money, like, cashback or whatever. Or I don't know what they call it. It's like a reward system for buying a lot of stuff. But, yeah. Me salió barata. I'm gonna go see your boyfriend, bitch. All right, you guys, so we're pulling up to the motherfucking OC Animal Care Shelter. Um, this is basically like an animal shelter in um, Orange County. It's actually more like towards Tustin, no? I would say, but me and Denny have actually came here before. I remember the first time we wanted a dog, we actually came here because they were having like a no fees, just pay like the... I don't know, they, they usually have like a lot of sales to try to like get not people... Sales not sales, but what is it called? They're like. Just like like clearance? Like, no, more. They, <laughs> they usually just have like specials where like you don't have to pay the go. fees like or the stuff like that. Fees. Adoption fees, like you just have to pay like ten dollars or something like that. Just the paperwork, you know. So sometimes like they even try to help you out so you guys can go ahead and adopt your dog. You guys should really come check it out, you guys. This is the OC Animal Care Shelter. It looks like this, you guys. Before you guys get any animal, you guys, I'm gonna be honest, I'm not really against buying or adopting, like I believe in both you know um but like one thing that i do believe in is if you're gonna get a dog first come to a shelter because they really need to love you guys and honestly i'm the type of person that i feel like you need to have like a connection with the pet so if you come to a shelter and you don't feel like there's a connection then do what you gotta do you know they have the todo tienen dogs rabbits barnyards so tienen hasta gallinas perros gatos todo i'm excited all right you guys so these are oh my god look at that rabbit Bro, that's a huge rabbit. Look at this one. Oh my gosh. Look at that, you guys. Hi. Okay, so the dogs are here, you guys. Hi. 
Hi, puppy. You okay? What happened to your ear? Oh, oh you scared me. Because I thought he was going to bite me. Look at him. Oh, he's a buddy. Oh, he's so cute. Oh, my God. This one's cute. Hello. Oh, this one's cute. Huh. He's 11 years old. I can't deal with another dog. Yeah, that. he's very old. Oh, he's cute Okay, you guys, so um, we're actually gonna go see one of the dogs because majority of the dogs that we liked all had a deposit on them and we could only do like one deposit per dog, so sucks. Um, but we're gonna see Odo and let's see if we like fall in love with him. Yeah, let's get So we ended up getting a visiting pass for one of the dogs. Um, we had multiple dogs that we liked, but a lot of them, well, most of them have deposits on them, which means that if no one claims a dog, um, it goes to the first person that gave a deposit and there's only allowed one deposit per dog. So the Pomeranians had deposits and um, the really big dog that Danny liked had a deposit, the Chihuahua had a deposit. So like most of the those had deposits which makes me really sad but um one out of the few dogs that we did like did not have a deposit so we're gonna actually visit him right now they're gonna take him out so we can play with him his name is odo odo's coming oh my god oh my god hi, hi. oh you're so cute does he shed a lot oh yeah hi. Hi. Oh, oh, you're he's so, so cute. Hi, baby. I like him too. He's really sweet. Okay, you guys. So we just got done with um Odo. Oh my God. I don't know what to do. He's so beautiful. He was very playful. But there was only one thing, you guys, that I'm not really like a fan of. And that's like the shedding. Like, I'm very picky when it comes to like shedding. And I don't like my house being full of pelos because for some reason it reminds me like when I was younger one of my tias gave me a couch well gave my family a couch and it was full of pelos hi hi how are you hi do you want to say hi to the vlog hi <laughs> so like I was saying I'm very picky when it comes to like the shedding because like I don't like my house being full of pelos so um I'm gonna really go home think about it um and see if I want to deal with that um let me tell you guys a little story my sister's dog she's so playful so beautiful but like sometimes I feel like I neglect her because like I don't want to like get pelos all over me which is so fucked up but like you know when you're trying to go out, like, you don't want to be peludo, you know what I mean? So, like, I'm really looking for a breed that doesn't, like, shed. So, I'll see what's up. All right, you guys, I got news for y'all. Okay, I'm gonna actually um, finish some things up right now, and I'll see you guys in the car. You guys, oh my god, it's fucking hot. I'm literally dying. But guess what? I'm a parent! Okay. Ah! <laughs> We're parents again! I'm all scared. You guys, why does he look like a viejito? Look at him. Yeah. I'm not gonna change myself. He has to get used to me. But you guys, we got a dog. We got a dog. His name is, what's his name, baby? Ralph. Ralph. Wreck-It Ralph. Wreck Ralph. Are you ready, Ralph? Guess what we got him, you guys? Carriola. I better go in there, baby. Go in there. Let me close this. Espera, you're gonna hit me. Um, so we came to TJ Maxx, you guys, because we want to get him, like, his bull, and we want to get him, like, all his cute little stuff. I'm a mom, bitch. Alright, you guys, so we are here. Um, oh my god. Oh my god, this sheep one's really cute, huh? Should we get a sheep one? Um, I like the sheep one. Oh my god, look at this one. This is like a snake one. No, this is like too open, you guys. I really like the sheep one. I don't want those. Those are ugly. I want like a little camping nest. Okay, so first of all, you guys, we gotta put him, um, we gotta get him like little pelotitas to play because he's teething really hard. So I want something for him to chew on. I don't know what we should get him. Maybe these, look, these. These are gonna be good for him for teething. Because he keeps like biting me. No, those are too big for his mouth. So I'm gonna get him these for right now at least. Wait, wait. ¿Qué? ¿Qué quieres? ¿Qué quieres, perrillo? ¿Qué? ¿Qué? Should, should I get him the cerveza? So he, can be, so he can be a fucking borracho? <laughs> yeah, he likes it. Okay, we're getting that. So we're getting this and that. Okay, hurry up, baby, because he wants to go home already. You can't touch him. You can't touch him. <laughs> you are scared, huh, Pada? Oh, he's so cute. I 
Girl, like like muffin, a, it's like, like muffin. muffin. Oh, that's small. Yeah, muffin is not small. Muffin's kind yeah, of small. muffin is really small. Hello, <laughs> Paka. Hey, pick up the little. Look at him. Look at him. Look at him. Be careful. Be careful. He's no, so you're fine. small. That is huge. Oh my god. Chingate algo, Martin. 